Welcome to the Namibia Statistics Agency, the NSA. The NSA was established after the passing of the Namibia Statistics Act, which is Act Number 9 of 2011. Under the Act, the NSA is mandated to collect official statistics and to coordinate the NSS and the NSDI. It is also the place where all statistics in the country are collected, produced, analysed, confirmed as being official and shared. The NSA also educates the public on how statistics and spatial data, also called geographic data, are used. But what is spatial data? Spatial data provides information about the specific locations of things on the Earth and their associated characteristics. For example, spatial data provides information not only of a particular location such as a business, but also the number of people that work there, the name of the business, contact details and the services such a business offers. This information is amongst others used by the Namibian government to plan, for example, where the best locations are for schools and clinics to be built. To manage Namibia's National Spatial Data Infrastructure, or NSDI, the NSA works with the Ministry of Agriculture, Water and Land Reform. However, agreements have been signed with various institutions that are participating to supply quality information to the NSA for public use. The number of institutions participating in the NSDI keeps growing. Currently, there are 57 local authorities, 14 regional councils, 20 partners on a national level and one international partner participating in the NSDI. The data feeding into the NSDI system is divided into 24 broad categories. This includes categories such as education, which includes schools, universities and vocational training centers. Health is another category and includes hospitals, health centers and clinics. Tourism as a category includes hotels, guest houses and tourism attractions such as museums, monuments, wildlife, etc. The NSA manages this flow of spatial data into the NSDI. In this way, Namibia is transformed into a digital map enabling reporting on land statistics, agricultural statistics, environmental statistics, and many more. You can access national spatial data online using the National Geographic portal, which is divided into two parts. The one part is called GeoFind, which produces information about available data, such as who produced the data. The other part is Digital Namibia, which is a map viewer that allows users to access and view maps digitally. You will be able to see maps of roads in the country, the location of people, buildings, rivers, mountains, minerals, rock types, national parks, monuments and much more. These platforms can be accessed by researchers, governments and other stakeholders to make informed decisions and carry out targeted interventions. For example, according to the Namibia 2011 Population and Housing Census report produced by the NSA, the percentage of Namibians living in urban areas increased from 33% in 2001 to 43% in 2011. As more people move to urban areas, informal settlements grow and expand. According to the 2011 Population and Housing Census main report, 27.2% of the urban population in Namibia live in improvised housing units. There is therefore a need for evidence-based planning in order to provide basic services to these communities. The availability of quality data enables proper and effective planning. As another example, when there is an outbreak of viruses such as Hepatitis E or COVID-19, they spread faster in informal areas because here people live very close together. Accurate and timely data enables easy identification of hotspots. This results in more targeted interventions, fast response time and mitigation measures. Linking geography to statistics is high on the United Nations Statistics Division agenda and many other statistical organizations like the NSA. Geographical data collected by the NSA and other data producer institutions is vital for producing quality statistics. 
The mission of the National Spatial Data Infrastructure, as outlined in the first NSDI Strategic and Action Plan, is to coordinate, facilitate and support the implementation of an information infrastructure. This ensures efficient production, use, maintenance and dissemination of relevant quality and accurate spatial information that is fit for purpose, particularly in providing evidence-based decision-making at all levels of society. The vision is to be a leader for quality spatial data delivery in Africa in accordance with international standards and best practices. Together, we are building a spatially enabled nation. Join this government initiative and let's build a spatially enabled nation.